Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Don of AhmedDon.com. Today I'll have another episode of unboxing and review video and I'll be trying the Wilkinson Sword Shaving Soap which I have it right here. If this is your first time or repeat visit, thank you for your support. On this channel I'm always trying new and different ideas. If you're into thinking outside the box, this is the channel to subscribe. If you're looking for more review videos, there'll be links in the description box below. So I purchased this and I wanted to give it a try and I'm going to open this up and do a review so before I do that so I just like to point out uh, this is a shaving soap cup uh, by Wilkinson Sword and this is actually a product of Edgewell that's the you know parent company and uh, this is the same company which makes uh, uh, products like Bulldog, uh, Chic uh, razors and uh, other sword uh, accessories and uh, men's uh, grooming's product and uh, this is uh, a shaving cup so you would require a brush to shave uh, but if you want I think you can just like you know use it with your fingers but that's not going to be a good idea and could be messy uh, but so the best use would be to you know use a brush and uh, I'm going to shave using this product and we'll you know see how good or bad it is so here uh, let me just to give you a quick uh, look at the ingredients so this is uh, let me see if I actually the camera can catch it properly so, okay so it looks like you should be able to see it here so you can see that you know these are the ingredients and I was just trying to you know uh, find out where this is made of uh, it doesn't mention actually where it's made of but it just has here that uh, distributed by personal care brands Edgewell Connecticut and they have an address in Hanover Ontario which is in Canada so I'm just going to open this kind of like you know uh, tape which is closing the cup and I don't it doesn't look like you can do it with your empty hand you might need to cut it so what I'm going to do I'll just use a scissor uh, you know knife to cut this little bit okay so it came out like this and I'll just remove this portion and even before opening the cup, I, I'm, I'm getting the shaving smell. Uh, so let's just, you know, open this. So this is how it looks. So you're going to have to use a brush. And let me just smell this for a bit. So this one has classic barbershop smell. And I, I kind of like it. It kind of like it reminds me of the old days. Uh, it's not very strong, uh, not too light. It's you know it's somewhere in the middle but I think the smell is nice and I like it so the next part of the video is going to be I'm just going to you know use this and shave and which I'll show you and then you know then I'll tell you whether you know I like uh, how it works or not so I have my Wilkinson sword vintage shaving soap bowl right here and I'm going to try this and then we'll you know talk about it how it feels or how good or bad it is before I do that I'd like to sh uh, mention that when you open the bowl it actually doesn't twist to close all the way so it's kind of just like you know moving but it really doesn't close and that's the way it is so in order to open it you have to just kind of like you know remove it by taking it out but it doesn't get closed this way so here it how it looks and I'm going to be using my Wilkinson sword uh, shaving uh, brush which I have it right here now you can use this part actually to like you know put uh, water in here and lather the uh, soap or if you don't need I have just you know my tap right here and I'm just going to take uh, with this brush with the water here and then here I'm just going to you know uh, do this way and then we'll see that you know how foamy or how lather it can get so it seems to be doing very well and I'm going to just like you know brush it here so the smell is actually vintage barber smell so whenever you're using it it's going to remind you that uh, it feels like that you know you're going to the barber and I'm going to see how is the leather so let's just uh, 
leather this up. And I'm just going to add a little bit of more water and I can do this again. And then we'll see you know, how it works. So this type of shaving, uh, it takes, you have to take your time, you know, you cannot rush to it. And I usually, if I have like, you know, somewhere to go or if I have work, I don't use the brush. I just, I would just use the uh, foam or just a shaving cream with my fingers. But I only use brush whenever, you know, I have time and I'd like to enjoy the shaving and take my time to shave. So this is how it looks here. and. The lather seems to be, you know, okay. I cannot really complain. And I'm going to be start shaving with uh, the Chic Hydra 5, uh, which is my common, uh, you know, razor. This is a five blade uh, razor which you can see and uh, let me just uh, glide it over to see you know how the shaving cream is working looks like it did its job you know my beard is uh, very uh, soft and uh, it doesn't like you know hurt or it's gliding very smoothly so I'm just going to try a little bit here and let me just try this side a little bit. Okay, so I'm just going to see, you know, if the soap is still in here. So I'll just like, you know, brush it again. And it looks like there's still like, you know, uh, soap remaining in the brush. So if you want to double it up, you can just do it again. And if you want to, you know, leather up even more, then you can just like, you know, brush here a little bit, and then it's going to give you more leather. So I'm just going to try a little bit more. Uh, that should be good enough for the review. So my take on this is that, you know, I'm more than impressed uh, given the price of this product. So this is the Wilkinson Sword Vintage shaving soap bowl and when i bought it it was around like you know five dollars and uh i bought it from amazon uh, you may or may not find it now kind of like you know they're on and off but you may be able to find it from other retailers but given the cost i would say that this is really you know impressive uh shaving soap bowl and i have nothing to complain about the smell i like it and it's not too light not too you know heavy uh, it's just right and it makes you like you know uh, remind you of going to the barber in the old days and uh, the quantity and the everything uh, even the like you know soap bowl we have here uh, that's a very great addition and even you can use this even if you just like you know finish this part and you can just buy another bowl and just put it in here because some of the soap uh, a shaving soap bowl uh, doesn't come with a case so you can use just uh, you know this case in the uh, future for later uses and the only thing is that you know it just doesn't close all the way but I think that's how it was made and there's uh, really nothing to complain uh, but if you want like you know more uh, tighter closing then you can just use a rubber band or uh, scotch tape when you're traveling so this is going to be a very good piece for traveling because uh, this is not wouldn't consider as like you know uh, a liquid for your carry-on uh, for those who only carry one bag uh, like the way I travel I usually carry travel with only one bag and I I don't like you know do any check-in so this is going to come in very handy because you don't have to worry about the liquid limit or anything because this is solid and overall uh, I'm happy with the product and uh, I have nothing to complain about uh, given the price and the quality and the way it works so definitely I'm happy and uh, just to mention that this is not a paid or affiliated review all my reviews are non-affiliated unbiased and honest uh, there are no affiliated links no nothing that would be all for today 
Thank you for watching this video. There will be more videos coming up, so I'll see you shortly. Thank you.